All right, so we're going to play Snoot Game. Scoot's not here because, I don't know, he's wrestling or something. But uh, <laughs> Shay's here. And uh, we're going to give some context for Shay because he's probably not aware of this. So Snoot Game is a parody of a game called Goodbye Volcano High. And they created this parody years ago before the game was even released. Because the trailer for Goodbye Volcano High uh, was kind of clown clowned on for not only its uh, weird kind of art style that looks like it's just, you know, kind of... It, it doesn't seem like... Uh, when they turn their heads that the proportions of their snoots are proper it seems like kind of kind of like that this is just my art style meme like someone's learning okay but they created an entire game anyway and this was a part of the PlayStation 5 showcase when i think they were promoting the new console i think this was before the PlayStation 5 was released or something i think this was yeah june 2020 and this was like, wait till you see all the great games that are going to be on PS5. And then this was the trailer that they released in 4K, by the way. So this is the context. And it kind of just looks like life is strange, but... You ever feel like you're just waiting for Like furry? <laughs> <laughs> to do that thing you've always meant to do. And, and so this felt very out of place, obviously. Sometimes I feel like I'm just standing on the edge of doing great things. In the showcase. It does almost feel but like just a meme. Something's holding me back. Yeah. Maybe it's just nerves. <laughs> just some of these shots Maybe are kind of weird. Maybe it's the fear that I'll never be as good as what I imagine when I'm still just standing on the edge. It does seem like nothing else to lose. indie visual novel that would appear on Steam, but Mine's has no job. business being in a PS5 showcase. Yeah. And it also seems like entirely derivative of like other games of this genre, you know, like Night of the Woods, Life is Strange, etc., etc. So. Yeah, get hype. So this was uh, over three years ago. I guess there's a meteor coming because fucking Life is Strange ended with a fucking end of the world scenario. And, you know, Donnie Darko, which obviously Life is Strange majorly ripped off. So um, I'm going to I'm a little curious about what the f so I'm just going to read a little bit about Snoot Gate. All I know is that it exists. And they created this June 2021. So people, there was like no word of Goodbye Volcano High for a long time. So that an entire year went by of Goodbye Volcano High since it was announced. And so somebody decided to make a parody game Sorry, <laughs> based did on the, that trailer. Did the game come out? It did like yesterday, two days ago. So I'm going to play the parody game that was created two okay. years ago. And we finally got Goodbye Volcano High. Yes. Um, After. but it, but this parody game was just created in the meantime. Um, and so we'll see, we'll see what the heck is going on here. Um, I think it was maybe like a 4chan thing <laughs> where they were just deciding to, to do this. So enable lewd images. Does anybody know if this is like Twitch bannable or like what's going on here? Right? Yes? Okay, so I... In order for something to be selected... It's like that. So I want to not have it selected. Don't risk it. Yeah, I'll just look it up later. Alright, so history? Dialogue history is empty. And then, I guess the other question is... Is there controller support? It seems unlikely. Oh, there is! Controller support for Snoot Game. All right. Uh, anything else I want to do in my options, I guess? No. Um, unseen, skip unseen text after choices, transitions. I don't know. Enable forward scroll movement. Doesn't really matter. Okay. Controller support. Does yeah. this, uh... Bot tricks only do. Uh... Ooh, yeah, we need to change the bot tricks uh, link because I I changed my Twitch 
uh, channel name. So give me a second while I give you a new link. Hold on. All right. Snoot game, everybody. Um, I don't want the chat to be blocking that. So maybe I do this for now. I'll just do this. Perfect. Hopefully I'm not blocking much. Squid game? Yeah, this is squid game, so. Uh, and we got controller support, it seems. All right, January 6th, which... Nice. I mean, this game came out... January 6th, 2021? I guess it did come out 2021, so this January 6th was, it would have been relevant. I don't know if this was intentional. Year 201 M2020 BC. <laughs> Volcadera Bluffs. Weather conditions cold as balls. <laughs> it's my first time living close to water. The idea of marine layer is new to me, but I do understand morning mist. This is this was like it, except infinitely more shitty. The heavy fog makes navigating to my new school more difficult as I fail to see anything five feet in front of me, like a runt of a tree planted in so the sidewalk that I swerve to avoid. It's my first time having to walk to school, too. My new apartment is in an awkward spot, opposite side of town, yet no school or public bus to take me from there. It's my first day at a new school. The second half of the first semester of senior year. I had six months left at my old school. I can't even imagine the kind of hell those six months would have been, but this, I should take my mind off of it. I whip out my phone and consider the best way to make people upset on the line. That was right. Okay. Save. Empty slot. Return. Online. All right. Reply to the obvious shell thread. Bait the obvious underage poster. Yeah, this is a 4chan thing for sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the thread goes 404 right as I'm ready to post my well thought out reply. Oh, shit. Better hide my phone before someone sees fit to take it from me. The only human around town, I think. The sounds that reach me first, the chatter of people milling about. Bro, it's been too long. It was only three weeks. Hee <laughs> hee. I can make out the building now. The fog shrouding gives the school an ominous vibe to it. I look at the name written on the arch over the entrance. Volcano High. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like a government building. Perfect setting for a horror game or maybe a, sh a shitty wad. What's a WAD? I don't know. <laughs> it feels like there's going to be quite a bit of... Doom mods? <laughs> the attempt at humoring myself just made me more, feel more alone. A check of my phone says I'm 30 minutes early. Wonderful. I moved to the entrance only to see all of the steps occupied by students. <laughs> it seems it seems like it could be from the game. <laughs> Their eyes turn to me, expressions of confusion and contemplation. It's so funny. Cause it is it is We'll see what the other game's like, but this feels like it could be like an alpha the other game, you know? I can feel their judging stares, the same that haunted me for four months previous. <laughs> that guy's got a weird tail. This is fucking great. Their tails are very much separate yeah <laughs> i love this <laughs> i can already picture what they're thinking dude check it out pride rock is that a skinny where's his spear aren't they all like spear chuggers or something <laughs> but he eats his own kind they probably see me as some kind of circus attraction and nothing more ha i'm the freak show among the cereal box mascot crowd <laughs> Taking acid is not nearly as colorful as going to Volcano High. I should write that down. As I write write that down on my phone's note app, I notice the surrounding students stopped looking at me, which is good. I can peep around the friend circles without a problem now. Not like I'll ever be a part of one anyway. So are you human and yes. you're going to furry school? Sorry, they're all dinosaurs. They're scalies. Okay, are they? I believe are so. Are birds scalies? I guess not. This one's an. This one's got wings. Talk about wanting to stand out. I never thought it was possible to look like you were from a black and white twenties cartoon. <laughs> this is so good. 
She does differ from the other Technicolor students, though, in the worst way possible. Oh, oh yeah, she's staring at me with that look. Fuck, fucking hell! Has she never seen a human in her life? I fucking hate that look. Contempt, judging, everyone that has looked at me like that never proved to be anything more than an asshole. Like, I'm the anomaly here. She's just as dumb and insufferable as the rest of them. She's probably no better than me, miss. My snout is so big I can land a plane on it. <laughs> Go back to your friends. <laughs> <laughs> huh, she did. She's a tail on her head, too? I guess so. That's fucking weird. <laughs> I feel like I should say something. I noticed that all this time my knees were weak and my arms were heavy. Let's <laughs> <laughs> vomit on my spaghetti already. <laughs> my feet carry me. If you take Adam out of YMS and replace him with Eddie Murphy, does anything really change? It's still YMS. Okay, hold on one second. I'm just gonna turn down the uh, sound volume. Does that mean like everything? There, now I can hear the Cool Cat TTS better. I can just move that up. Thanks for the sub, Silver 16X. I'm just gonna replay that just to give a test for the uh, Cool Cat levels here. Just make sure everything sounds good. If you take Adam out of YMS and replace him with Eddie Murphy, does anything really change? It's still YMS. Okay. It should be fine. I think the levels are probably good. Let me know. Yeah, the music's not bad for like a shit post, you know? It feels like quality free play. I mean It's probably yeah, it might be free play. Um Yeah. My feet carry me over the soggy grass as I look for somewhere else to be. On the side of the building is where I find sanctuary. Ah! It's a small alcove of sorts. <laughs> <laughs> the pavement is cracked to bits and the shrubs surrounding it are overgrown. Even the bench cracked paint and on rotten wood held between two concrete legs matched the abandoned vibe of the place. It was perfect. <laughs> I flopped down on the wet bench and the violent crack from <laughs> it makes my heart drop. Almost perfect, but good enough. I feel a tightness in my chest and my lungs fight to draw air in. <laughs> Heads in my hands, I can fully understand what I've done now. Six months in a new school. A year on my own in some run-down apartment in a town I know nothing about, all on my own. Three weeks. It took a day for me to want to change schools. Three weeks to make it happen, and now this is my life for the next year. I think back to my old man's ultimatum. Once the lease is done and on, either college or the service. I don't care which. Oh, Anon. Whoa, would you happen to be a non? <laughs> I look up. <laughs> the bench broke down. Up! I lay on the ground, ass hurt from hitting jagged concrete and splintered wood. Thank God for jeans. Oh my goodness, are you okay? I groan. Never better. I instinctively apply my chill guy facade in the presence of strangers to hide how uneasy I am today. A hand is held over my face. In my pain, addled confusion, I shake it. Naser? <laughs> right, right. This is the an interesting one. This, like, boomerang. Yeah. <laughs> Good, I'm not Guitar sure pick. what it is. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the hand tightens around my own and pulls roughly. Oh, it's... Oh, yeah, it was spelled N-A-S-S-E-R in the actual trailer. Nasser. <laughs> uh, the force is enough for my feet to get under me stumbling back up to stand before the pair of strangers it also felt like enough force to pull my arm out of its socket uh sup uh Shay would you like to voice the character of Nasser Nasser uh sure Go for you're it. a nun yeah and then this other I'm one I'm glad we found no. you this is another. This is the other character. Oh, we don't shit. I'm glad we found you. Who are you guys? Why do you know my name? We're my 
matters. My name is Naomi, student council president and your guide. It's my serious pleasure to make it is your pleasure to make your acquaintance and on. We're your welcoming committee. Oh, okay then. Is that really necessary? I have prepared the dish for you. The orange one, Naomi, hands me a brochure. <laughs> Volcano high in you, a new beginning to adulthood. The title alone makes me gag. The orange one, Naomi, <laughs> looks at me expectantly. The brochure is full of the typical trivialties. College prep, financial assistance, after school programs, none of it matters. Babe, I've got some <laughs> things to take care of. <laughs> Naser looks back to the school entrance. I follow his eyes and see some people trying to lift a large speaker up the stairs of the school. Uh-oh. I'll see you at lunch, right, Nasser? <laughs> she looks dejected. Uh, <laughs> of course. <laughs> Nasser pulls her into a hug and nudges his his muzzle against hers. <laughs> Is that how dinos kiss? Well, <laughs> he leaves running quickly to assist with the heavy sand equipment. Ahem. I turn back to Naomi. She smiles again, though there is a plasticity to it. <laughs> so, Anon, why did you transfer here? The question catches me off guard. <sighs> I freeze like a deer caught in headlights, scrambling to come up with any plausible answer. It's an innocent question. She can't have known, could she? What did Mom and Pop put in the tr uh, transfer request form when they shipped uh, my ass here? Uh, I... You uh, don't have to answer if you don't want to. I focus my attention on the brochure out of embarrassment. Lunch, right, I'm getting kinda hungry. What about something to eat? Yada 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 herbivore vegan tofu, disgusting. Wait, hold on, carnivore line, filet mignon, what the fuck is wrong with this school? <laughs> is there a soup kitchen or something around here? Oh dear, Anon, are you in need of financial assistance? I can figure things out on my own, don't worry too much about it. Oh, the school here has programs to help its less fortunate students. The principal here is great. Come on, I'll take you to him. The absolute last thing I want to be doing is asking for handouts. Actually, actually, I. Naomi grabs my hand and. Uh. Ah! Alert! Alert! Defcon level one. Defcon level one. Female making physical contact. Do not panic. Do not panic. Get a grip on the situation. <coughs> this is Naomi. She's taking me somewhere by the hand. 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 She already has a boyfriend, doesn't she? Wait, she already has a boyfriend. I am safe. <laughs> okay, okay. Just stay silent and don't make a mess of things. Did the uh, warning sirens audio come through okay for everybody watching? Let me know. It's so soft and smooth and surprisingly warm for scales. How lewd. <laughs> Day one, I've already fallen into such depraved lows and hand-holding. <laughs> Here we are, and I'm Principal Spears should be able to help with your money situation. What? Oh, right. Naomi knocks on the door. State your business. The new student needs financial help, Principal Spears. Lend, Lend him, him a five. A five. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're Spears. I think he might, he means the loan program, sir. Tell him to come in later. I'm dealing with another student. Thanks for the sub, Looney. Uh, new character. Yeah, fucking hell, you ain't I have to clean up after. Yeah. The orange parasorophilus. Par Parasorophilus's expression quickly changes from whatever that was to the same smile she's had up until now. <laughs> Well, then, Nine, why don't I show you the class? Homeroom should be starting soon. Right, homeroom. I take out my crumpled schedule from my pocket. Naomi takes the slip from me and blows my eardrums out with a squeal capable of shattering glass. We say your first period in English together. <laughs> Come on, I'll introduce you to the class and you'll be able to make all sorts of new friends. Yay, me. I follow her after her to a classroom on the second floor. The seats were being filled with students. I take one near the front knowing I'll have to introduce myself. I'll probably be doing that for all my classes. Fuck my life. This I like this, this art style that's probably just <laughs> photographs through a filter. Yeah, but, exactly. Um, just a random Google image yeah. put through a, a 
terrible filter. Yeah. The artificial ring of a bell blares from a speaker on the wall. With it, everyone, with it, everyone waits as the teacher finally enters the room and shuts the door. Oh, God! <laughs> Mr. Suki. Ohayou gozaimasu, karasu. Today, you have a new karasu meto to boruke no hai. What? Anon-kun, please come up and introduce yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Naomi coughs and makes a subtle nod up. Damn, Scoot's, Scoot's missing. He would love to do this. <laughs> he shouldn't have taken the day off. Oh, I stand from my seat and face the class. Once again, all eyes on me and the tightness in my chest returns. I inhale deep, willing my erratic heart to slow. I feel like I almost need subtitles for his text. I, As I was sounding it out, it made sense. <laughs> As I was just reading it phonetically, yeah. <laughs> I started to understand it was English with a thick accent. <laughs> hey. Again, those eyes, just like three weeks ago. My name is Anon. I, uh, just like every day for the past four months, I don't really have any hobbies. I wanted to flee, hide away. Anything to avoid those judging eyes. What was your own school like? <laughs> My throat clenches. I think back to uh, to it all. Uh, I there's whispers now. The hushed tones, silent snickers, blending with the f, f ever present stares. I was about to say effervescent. <laughs> My heart ham. My heart hammers at my chest, and I am sure that they can all hear it. See the cold chill racing over me. Anunkun, you do not have to anat. Zatu, <laughs> answer Zatu. <laughs> His words snapped me out of my trance. Only Naomi was looking at at me. The rest were preoccupied, either talking about their winter break or catching up on sleep. They've all been ignoring me the entire time. Prizu reteno tio yoshito anangun. Hi, now kras. That was nothing like my Japanese animes. <laughs> Mr. Tsuki continued on, drawing what little attention there was to himself. I sat down, finally feeling the blood that had caught in my legs rush up, leaving me lightheaded. And I probably have to do this for each class today? Double fuck my life. Awkward introduction after awkward introduction to classmates that couldn't care, kept le <laughs> care less kept me anxious the whole morning. And there's still the rest of the day to go. His weird posture. He's like broken at his ribs. You know? It's very He's reminiscent. leaning back at the top. <laughs> it it's, looks like uh, the the c kind of characters you get in, in like driver's ed books and stuff. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. He does look like a crash test dummy. Yeah. Look at his head. The ear. Eventually, lunch comes around. All the edible stuff is well outside my price range of fucking free, so I settle for a pseudo-pizza, the kind that becomes a viable weapon if you leave it alone for ten minutes. No time to waste after exiting the line. I scan the lunchroom for an open seat. I thought I had found a decent spot in the corner when disaster struck. Up. Oh! Uh-oh. <laughs> Said disaster was a hand grabbing my shoulder and turning me about. My plate of pizza-shaped cardboard threatened to smear across my shirt. I fought the momentum of the tray until the hand that had spun me stabilized it and me. Whoa there, nearly dropped your food anon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, whose fault was that? Yours. I swear to God, so I swear to all that is good and holy. Wanna sit with us? What? Wanna sit with me and Naomi, since you're new and all. He points to a table where the living pink sugar rush is waving. God damn it. I don't want to make a scene. Sure. Before I even sit down, the barrage of questions begins. So, what do you think of Okay, Ohio? Do you you guys, you seem to. St just, I just nod along, starting to not pay attention. You're looking forward to the rest of the day? Not really. All these introductions, you know. I get you hard to talk to people you don't know, right? Something like that, yeah. Hell, last period I tripped in front of everyone. Talk about a first impression. I don't think they'd care too much. <laughs> Have you had any trouble since then? Have you, I'm mean, only for food today? 
Oh, you're short on food money, man? <laughs> Not really. I just got to sign up for some handouts. Naomi is starting to look disappointed. I'm only picking up on Nasser's interjections. Nasser? <laughs> if you need a bit more extra chow, there's going to be free refreshments at my C... Uh... At Fang's concert after school I think today. it was supposed to be sister. Your what? Fang. Your brother or... Sibling? What? <laughs> Fang's going to have some extra pizzas for the show. You could take some home. I uh, don't know about concerts. Not really one for public events like that. All right, man. Just thought you could use a few opportunities to make friends. What was that? I'll assume that wasn't meant to be malicious. <laughs> I'll consider it. Hey, don't leave me out of that conversation. Oh, where the hell are you going to some cheap food after school? I know some great vegan shops in the area. My stomach rolls at the V word. Maybe another time, sorry. So about that concert, Nasser. <laughs> Dinner and a show? Sign me the fuck up. <laughs> How am I supposed to pronounce the? Is it a real name? Sorry, I gotta. I'm looking up the pronoun. <laughs> I'm so confused. Nasser. Okay, that's former president of Egypt, and then with one S, it's Nasser. Nasser, like. An Australian saying NASA. <laughs> NASA. Or British. <laughs> NASA. All right. All right, it's your line. Oh, uh, music? Music? Yes. What kind? The kind you listen to. What? Well, what genre? The good kind? You don't know, do you? No. Well, free food is free food. Have I seen the Nasser meme? What? Where somebody's name was that and it the game thought that it was something else and it turned into two stars or three stars or something and it Oh yeah, it's some the game censored out the word ass and changed his online chat oh my to N God. star 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 <laughs> ER. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which made it much worse. It is it's a yeah. real name, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's in the YMS highlights. Okay, that's cool. that's kind of funny. Yeah. That's <laughs> hilarious. I look at my pizza, noticing something is wrong. I test it with my plastic spork and watch the cheap utensil shatter to bits. I curse life for a third time today. The dreaded 10-minute mark has passed, rendering my pizza only useful as building material. Oh, dear. Nay, sir. <laughs> Why don't you split your sandwich with him? But it's my sandwich. It's fine, we can split my vegan TLT. <laughs> tomato, lettuce, tomato. <laughs> Nasser shudders and looks at his own footlong Philly sub longingly. Uh, sure thing, babe. Where he tears the sandwich in two and hands me the larger half. Here, Nan. I will never forget your brave sacrifice. With that, we all dig into our meal. After school. My classes after lunch were the same as before it. By now, I had rehearsed introduction that only the teacher cared about. My classmates were disinterested, and I would sit down to be forgotten. I hope the rest of the year is just like that. I want to skate through it all. And that's all, all that's left for today is the concert and dinner. I wait outside the auditorium entrance with Nasser, who was checking his phone for messages. Right. Fang says the show's starting in a bit. See? Nasser turns the screen to me. Okay, sorry. <laughs> Fang, piss off. Is the pizza here? You can have a slice. But after that, you GTFO. FWR. FWR? Like Franklin W. Roosevelt? Nah, fucking wing retard. Fuck <laughs> wing retard. <laughs> Fang's words, not mine. <laughs> Is your uh, sibling always like this? <laughs> Fang's. I wait for him to continue. 
Well, um, I mean, kinda. Glad I'm an only child. <laughs> Nasser glares at me. Fang's still family. Ah, sorry, just saying it is all. Nasser deflates. You're good, Anon. And yeah, they're family, but Fang's just so... So... Difficult? Yes, difficult. And I don't know why. Sounds rough. It is. Like, I know they care about... Care, but Fang doesn't even want to be around me. Hmm. Finally, the doors open and I smell the cheesy, heart-clogging goodness within. Sweet. Come on, Anon. A caveman of a man holds open the door for everyone. Wait! His massive hand stops me. Uh, uh, yes? I'm guided to the side away from the crowd that's filtering into the auditorium. Oh, God. So how are you feeling about a lovely school, Anon? Uh... It's the spear-shaped pin on his lapel that reads principal that informs me of who this giant is. Oh, oh, it's uh, nice. Cleaner than my old school, he guffaws and slaps his chest. So I think you were spears earlier. Yeah. yeah. You can thank your classmates for that. What? Now go enjoy the show. Yes, sir. Oh, I do need you to come by my office tomorrow for some paperwork. I nod and go back to the door where Nasser is standing, holding it open for the last of the audience to go inside. His hand in his pocket is very funny. <laughs> kind of just disappears in there, too. There's, like, no bulge There's of his a, yeah. hand. It's It goes straight into his body. Yeah, he's hiding his uh, missing hand. <laughs> Stump. Nasser leads me and the large crowd into the shitty school theater. The foyer has tables with boxes of pizzas stacked taller than me. You can take a couple boxes after Anon. That should help you out. Who the hell got all these anyway? I did. I take a box down from the stack. Others have already started stacking their plates. I check the logo on the box. And to get so many larges from Dino Mo's Pizza? That's a couple hundred bucks, though. Meh, about a month's allowance. A month? That explains that disaster of a jacket. So, about the actual show. I'll check on them. Be right back. <laughs> Left on my own, I stack my plate up with some quality grease-topped delight. I lean against the wall, chewing bits of Supreme and ob observing the rest of the crowd. Another shit show. Oh, different character. She's so stupid. Did even bother? Bunch of losers. Everyone seems to share the same sentiment, so why the hell did they even show up for this? Nasser finally comes back and opens the door to the main hall. The crowd moves in, though I hang back so I can talk with Nasser. What's with them, Nasser? What do you mean? The crowd. They were all talking mad shit. What? Nasser grasps the air at the air, unsure what to think or do at the moment. I think he's angry. Seems very angry. Ah! That was the best animation. Whoa, whoa. Ugh, I should have known. I don't... What are you talking about, man? I brought them here so Fang has an audience. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Nasser's phone rings. He moves aside to answer it. Uh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> the voice on the other side is loud and shrill. Yeah, I... <laughs> he holds the phone away from his ear to save his eardrum. Okay, okay, I... The call ends and Nasser sags. I've got to leave. Seriously? Yeah, Fang doesn't want me here. Said I'll ruin the show. Harsh. Look, whatever happens, promise you won't hold this against them. They're actually a really nice person once you get to know them. Nasser, why did you just murder the English language in cold blood? Within, I see the rest of the audience huddled in groups around tiny snack tables. 
even went to the trouble of switching out the seats for them. Naomi said it'd help. With a huff, Nasser turns away, begrudgingly leaving the auditorium. I enter the hall and take a seat in the back, away from the rest of the crowd. The lights dim and the curtains are drawn open. <laughs> On stage is a trio of people my age. I think Fang is the drummer? He doesn't look related to Nasser. Maybe it's the main front woman? That must be Nasser's sister. Who? Then why the whole confusion over her sex, for fuck's sake? I'm just getting thrown around today. I don't know. She looks familiar. The band doesn't bother introducing themselves. Instead, the purple one begins plucking the, her bass. It all went tumbling down from there. What I thought was guitar a guitar sounded horrifically wrong, far too heavy. The lead guitarist was using a fucking bass. Then the vocals kicked in. It was its horrific screeching combined with the amadelius a, a, a melody, melodious shredding on a bass created a cacophony, a cacophony equal to hundreds of cats ritualistically sacrificed. I fight the urge to cover my ears. I don't know too much about music, but even I know that you don't use two basses in one hand unless you know exactly what you're doing. Oh, no. Oh, God. <laughs> what were they thinking? I looked back to the crowd to gauge their interest. Surely I'm not alone in thinking this is an absolute travesty. <laughs> ah, they still fucking suck. <laughs> <laughs> This is the future of music. Just remove them already. This music is great and trying to cringe challenge. The worst thing to happen to Dinosaur in 666 and I'm majoring in art. The band. This is the future of music. I imagine not having a city rock band. Tumblr. Wait for another extinction event. The worst thing to happen to this music is great trying to cringe. This is the future of music. Okay, there's a lot of the same. They're just repeating. Imagine. Yeah, 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 yeah. The crowd was standing, jeering and laughing with whoever said that. More words were said, but the laughter eclipsed them and the music. Wait, what happened to the music? On stage, the trio looked panicked. The drummer was inching off stage while the purple bassist was about to break down into tears. But the front woman stood there, stood her ground. Fuck you! <laughs> she tossed her bass aside, raising both hands and proudly displaying a finger on each of them. Fuck all of you! No one would want to. F oh. No one would want to fuck you, bitch! <laughs> that struck a chord with her. This music is great, trying to cringe, I just removed them already, the worst thing, blah, blah, blah. I watch as she grabs her bass and takes the arm of the purple one, rushing off stage with the pink drummer. Raptor Jesus imagine the smell in their clubhouse. Oh god, I can't take this, I'm gonna throw a six pack from laughing so much, I'm just gonna grab my pizza and leave. I turn towards the door and see Principal Spears, a fierce glaze freezing me in place. Anon? Oh fuck. His voice is even more stern than this morning. Y yes sir He looks to the crowd and then to me. I don't want to hear about any of this come tomorrow. I expect some goddamn maturity from you, Anon. You'll be an adult once you graduate. Uh, why me though? I've taught many students, and I can tell these things. Uh! His hand lands on my shoulder. <laughs> its grip was firm as it weighed on me. Listen here, Anon. You're not the only person in the world. Everyone's fighting their own battles. The hand squeezes before pushing me towards the door. I want to see you in my office first thing tomorrow. Now get out of here. This is the only warning you'll get from me. Next time it'll be campus cleanup. Behind me, the principal's voice shakes the room. Whose sorry ass am I gonna have to suplex? <laughs> <laughs> Back in the foyer, I see some boxes of partially finished pizza left. I consolidate them all into pa a pair of boxes and make my exit. The sun is starting to set now as I make my way home. You are not the only person in the... Oh, that's you. I think I, that was in his head, so... You're not the only person in the world. <laughs> like, I don't already know that. There's, like, the classmates that all ignored me today. Naomi's annoying ass. That fucking caveman of a principal. Nasser, who's been a bro. <laughs> Nasser's sis. Oh, shit.
Well. The next day. All right, I'm going to save here. <laughs> Empty slut. So I'm going to see. I want, I'm want. i curious how many days are in the, I know that this is like a short game because it's a parody. Let's see. Snoot game. How many days? Okay, apparently it's like two to three hours or something. Just one really long green text. Yeah. Why is there a save, save option if there aren't any choices to make? Apparently there's different endings. Uh, I got to pee. I'll be right back. I think I'm going to grab another beer as well. <laughs> 